That's disheartening. So, yeah, that was very sad. <laughs> oh, man. It was so cheap, too, because those guys just sitting there eating you, it's like, well, okay, so now I'm down a fighter for no particular reason. Um, you might as well pick up this and that. It's kind of garbage else. So, oh, I need to sell some stuff. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. And that. Um, I'm going to need to get some real easy missions to level up my guys again. Because my best fighters are dead. Actually, six nomads. That's not bad. Let's do that. Get him. Get him. There we go. remember if that has two range or not. I'm not going to wait to find out. You're fine there. That's a good hit. Yeah, you stay put. Pocket sand. Ow! Okay, so big hammer. Turns out that hurts. Everybody is missing. Yeah. There we go. Okay, he's knocked out.
And now he's dead. Even better. Um... Well, my guy's knocked out. That's okay. That's a good hit. Okay, you wait. You can swing. Okay, he's running. So that is less of a concern. Might as well try to kill him. There we go. Good hit. Even better. Looks like he's running now, which is good. Okay, I shot my own guy in the back. That's a thing. There we go. Kills, some levels, got some decent armor out of it. I'll take it. Okay, who needs armor? You need armor. There we go. Okay, so you are better equipped. He just ate one of your dudes in one hit. Can you not hire people who are higher tier than level one? Um, I can, but it's hard for me because I'm a peasant militia, and most of the people who are more than level one are going to be lords or knights or something like that. Um, they also cost like three to four thousand dollars, and I don't have that much money to play around with. Are there better weapons? Uh, can you find rare swords and magic ones? Yes, you can. Um, the side quest that I found uh, in that random water mill. That is a quest to get a unique item. Um, if I can actually complete it and figure out, you know, everything to do with it, sort it out, uh, then I'll get a unique something. 
In that case, it looked like a sword. Uh, you could use some more defense, some more attack, and some more fatigue, because I like you to be able to do things. Reach advantage is always a good idea for guys that are fighting in the back. Uh, you... Your armor sucks, and I want to replace it. Uh, okay. Okay. Day 88, rebuilding my forces. It's not bad. Nobody's super injured. I might... Yeah, let's repair you. And... Let's repair you. Probably you. See if I can't find some more equipment for these guys. Uh, you're an established settlement. I'll go for you. Okay. Might as well sell you now. Sell that. Sell that. Uh, repair those and I'll sell them in a sec. Don't really need these. Or that. Nothing much in the way of armor. Might as well sell you. Okay. Uh, you can have this. And let's repair you two. Probably just sell the bow as is, honestly. Uh, what do we got? Three days. Get some more food. What's your mission? Thievery. Stolen idol of fertility. <laughs> All right, what's it worth? Three fifty. That's fine. Follow the tracks. Uh, let me see how well healed I am right now. Uh, you need a day. Yeah, okay. Where am I going? West. Wee. Six thieves. Running into the forest. What bastards. There we go. Just some raiders. That's not bad. Ah, oh, he's got a flail. Okay. You can wait. That's a good hit. Uh, nah, you can stay put for now. You might as well stay put as well. Uh, you are one of my new guys, and thus kind of garbage, so you can put a shield up and just wait. Nice hit. There we go. Moving on. Eighty three percent chance and still missed. It's impressive.
can go there in preparation. Ah, he's going around. Yeah, it's fine. And nice. Uh, see if you can knock him out. Excellent. Doggo. Oh, no. You can wait. And you don't really have a shot. That's a good hit. Just gonna repast. And he's dead. Ah, well. Uh, yeah. Excellent. Don't want to shoot the doggo. Go doggo, go. Nice. Good job, doggo. You can wait. Good hit. You're fine. Knock him out. Excellent. There we go. Nobody died. No injuries that I can see. Some decent equipment. I'll repair some of it. Sell the rest. Everything else isn't really worth it. Levels? Nobody leveled up. Okay. Back to town. Go. Oh. Yeah, I'm a little surprised that it's almost day 90 and I haven't found a, uh, a specialty weapon yet. 
usually be able to. Got my men a little drunk. That's always fun. It's a stone keep. Let's go down here. I'm actually losing Renown. I wonder if uh, <laughs> betraying people like that was a, a bad idea. Maybe a little. Just a, just a hair. Um, sell you, sell you. Don't need these two swords. You're worth it. And, yeah, okay, there we go. Get some ammo. What's the job? Brigands have been taking off with my precious livestock. Uh, okay. 740. 780 is better. Drive off the brigands at Crumbled Homestead. I'll take that job. Everybody's still healed. Nobody's having an issue. We've got enough food to run out there and back. Let's go. Brigand marksmen and raiders. And they're on a hill. Uh, they're probably going to just stand there and pelt me. So that sucks. Okay, we're on the we're on the upside of the hill, so that's okay. Ow. Fucking crossbows, man. Okay, you can wait. can't go through here, so you can go here, shield up. Uh, go here. You can wait. You can hide. something at least. Um, let's see. Let's move you forward. Move you back here. Move you back here. My archers are wide open, but that's okay. Move you up. Yeah. Not bad so far. Although that guy's hit was painful. first victim has arrived. Hold him still.
There we go. Little surrounded, that's okay. Nice. Kill him? You can. We got one guy running away. That's good. Might as well kill him. And now he's running. All good things. Treating. Nice. <laughs> Did not expect that to work. I do like when they try to run away and just get mauled. Kind of makes me happy. Might have to let him go. Unfortunately. Kill the guy already. Yeah. 
There we go. I'm not going to be able to catch him, so I just let him go. Some people leveled up. You got a pierced side. You got a grazed neck. It's not bad, all told. Ooh, an actual crossbow. And a worn mail shirt, some more kite shields. Excellent. With the battle drawing to a close, a few enemies drop to their knees and beg for mercy. The Super Justin the Third looks to you for what to do next. All right, Super Justin, you have a choice. Do you want to kill them? Or do you want to take their arms and chase them away? Since it's your character doing it, I thought I'd ask. <laughs> No, their weapons. Not their not don't cut off their arms, no. <laughs> Although that would definitely make them not do it again. <laughs> I mean fair, yeah. So what do you think? Let them go? Let them go. Okay. Take their arms, chase them away. There's been enough killing and dying today, you let the prisoners go, taking their arms and armor before sending them off. Aren't you benevolent? Alright, and you leveled up. Looks like you're going to be a better archer than anything. Don't really need an archer, but, you know. Uh, get you Colossus. Wilfred, level 3. Get him Crippling Strikes. Get him Colossus. So many new people. Uh, that and that. It's like most of my front line died. <laughs> uh, who do I have left that's... Wilfred, you get a kite shield. And, uh... 2015. Go ahead and swap that out. Uh, you. You need a better helmet, I think. Better shirt. Better helmet. Might as well repair that and that. Now the crossbow is interesting. It's only got six tiles range. But... 70% effective against armor. And 40 or 50% goes right through the armor, so instantly it kills them. Uh, no, they weren't stealing food. Um, they were remnants from the battle. somebody that could use. Alright, back to town. Seven hundred and eighty crowns. We've got a pile of cash. Might as well make a little more. Don't need you or you. Might as well sell you. Don't need you or you. And get rid of you. Which 
to her value. 233. What are you selling for now? That's nah, fine. Um. These guys do not have much. I don't need the ammo. I don't need the grain. Might as well use the red paint on somebody. No. There we go. It's an ugly painted helmet. <laughs> uh, what time is it? 4.30. I got some time yet. Uh, what do I want to go? I'm going to cancel the ambition for the arena fight. Uh, how bad is my morale at the moment? It's not terrible. Let's go somewhere to a ta with a tavern, and then I'll cancel it. Because I am tired of winning or losing high-level guys to arena fights. That's bullshit. Paladin of Lions is now drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, uh, the ancient city has fallen under the banner of Northern Crusaders. While the old gods no doubt rejoice, the followers of Gilder will presumably seek to have, to have it taken back. This may present opportunities for the left toes. Uh, okay, so an ancient city has fallen under the banner, banner, a banner of Northern Raiders. I don't know which one. Honestly, don't. <laughs> So there's a war going on. Use the red paint on the dog. <laughs> there's a war going on, and I have no idea where it is. But let's cancel the ambition. My men are slightly disappointed in me. But that's okay. How's my renown? Yeah, I lost a little bit of renown, but that's okay. Yep, dissatisfied. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. Uh, go ahead and sell you. What's the contract? We've got a shipment of doesn't matter. It's going to Ravisted for five days. Let's talk money. 34 crowns per heads you arrive with uh, for up to 25 heads and two grand for the job. I don't think we can actually do this because most of my front line is still level one or two. So I don't think I think I'll pick that one up. Whoa. Rubbing his back and his neck, nervously pulling at the front of his shirt, he proposes a plan wherein he goes into town with a handful of goods to peddle around as he's done so often in the past. Only problem is he doesn't yet have the goods. He has to buy them from some local in the nearby hinterlands. All he needs now is a bit of money to get him started. Yeah, okay. Let's do that. Hey, all right. He got some extra cash, got some resolve, and now he's eager. Fantastic. Let's go... Let's go to Sandmark. Assuming we can make it that far. Mostly because they're bound to have decent jobs.
Do you have any food to buy? Some bread, I'll take that. Actually, I'll take some medicine as well. Some decent armor. Basic male shirt, what do we got? And away we go. Actually, Widemark is friendly, so we'll go to them instead. Uh, it's good seeing you again. If you'd like to do that work. Okay. We need a caravan going to Breitenberg. It's three days east. Three days for 1300 How much am I paying my men? 172 It's something to do. That's fine. Okay. So I'm going to get the battle standard, because I can afford that right now. Plus, it's a good weapon. Okay, we gained a pile of renown. People are now actually happier. I have a decent attack stick for somebody. Uh, probably you, matter of fact. So 50 to 70. Actually, let's give it to you instead. It's a polearm. That's a spear. Have you gotten... No. Okay, let's give you that. There we go. People are pleased. Everybody's happy. And we fulfilled an ambition. So we got a pile of renown. Excellent. Hopefully nothing jumps out in attacks us. Okay. Defeat a group of at least a dozen opponents? I can do that. I've done that a few times, as a matter of fact. Excuse me. Oh. The banner is, um, it's a morale weapon, so I can run up to somebody who is wavering and they'll actually increase morale, and then I can also stab somebody in the face with it. So it's, uh, it's kind of good on two sides. What the hell? Shouting and yelling drags you from counting inventory. You find a few of your men standing opposite ends of the campfire, pointing fingers, and even a weapon or two. Seems there's a bit of dust up over whose women are more beautiful, Southerners or Northerners. Ironically, the Northerners are voting for Southerners and vice versa. <laughs> a couple of stern commands brings order back to the company, but tension remains. People got injured because they were fighting. Okay, made a pile of money. Ooh, we have contracts from the Royals. Uh, what can I, what say I give you a task, you're not just paid just for doing it, but paid by how many heads you can collect. Uh, need
needs Fellswell and Weidenbach patrolled. Take a stroll, kill things here and there, and then return to me within five days with whatever you've collected. How much are we talking about? So 260 bucks advance, 51 crowns per head I bring back. For up to 30 heads. Fellswell, Weidenbach, Breitenberg. Return within five days. Okay. So I need to go to Fellswell. Fellswall. Fellswall. That's what it is. And check that out. If I kill anything on the way, I get paid for it. How am I men doing? Slightly injured. That's okay. Working for the Royals uh, tends to actually pay a lot better than some of the towns do. Going to buy some food while I'm here. And some equipment because it's there. Okay. And then to Weidenbach. I haven't encountered anybody yet. Which is kind of a shame. Uh, those are cheap. I'll go ahead and pick them up. And then back to Breitenberg. It's a boring trip, but hell, if I can find somebody to kill. It could actually pay really well, I just need to actually find somebody. I could kill some spiders, there's only nine of them in a forest, which is good or bad. Don't know if this counts towards the heads, but let's find out. here. That's fine. Put a shield up. You're good there. Okay. 
All right, that got him down. Spiders, thankfully, are fairly weak. Ah. Of course, you actually do have to hit them. There we go. Anybody else around? Not that I can see. There's apparently two other spiders floating around somewhere. But I can't find them. Just move up here. That's fine. You're fine there. That's fine. And I'm, I'm thinking they're probably running away, so I'm not going to find them. And they're gone. If I'm lucky, that counts as heads along the road. It does! Extra cash. Excellent. Some people leveled up. Okay, you leveled up. Very cool. you crossbow. Hmm. Maybe. Uh. No. Overwhelm, no. Lone wolf. No. I don't need that. Footwork I could use. You leveled up. Not much there. We'll go ahead and get that. You don't need Colossus. We'll go for that instead. Alright. Hi, Kronos. I've got three days to do this, so I'm going to kind of walk around Breitenberg and see if I can find some more guys to kill. Some extra loot. Because most of my guys... Yeah, nobody's injured. Hi, Kronos. Mm, 
not much around. Okay. Back to Breitenberg. 459 crowns. It's not much. It's something. Really dirt cheap tools. I'll take that. Could use some more food. Ammunition is, is dirt cheap too. Odd. Um, could use a basic male shirt. Probably go ahead and sell the war fork. You don't need it. You could use it. That's fine. Okay. How much food do I have? Four days worth. Release the hound. <laughs> uh, need two more. Uh, what are you referring to, Super Justin? gonna give me a discount I might as well pick up the ammunition too oh yeah you're absolutely right that's okay though now a heavy crossbow would be excellent a war bow that would be fantastic I can't afford it but that would be fantastic okay so let's see if Fell's Wall has anything for me. I'm thinking this might be one of the houses that's at war. But I don't actually know. Okay, basic contract. Uh, raiders, survivors begin to talk. Greenskins. 130 and 5. Okay, I'll take that. Probably going to die, but around Tenton Legan, where is that? Ah, need to travel for this one. It's okay, bro. Hopefully I don't come across 12 goblins, because goblins suck. It's okay. Uh, Crusaders from the north have taken the Oracle. You're not sure if this means the war is soon to be at an end. It would be a shame if that were the case, and all this strife has made for such great opportunities. My cat is currently cuddling my arm. <laughs> Come across a goatskin tent beside the road. 
The hide tarps have been dipped in purple dyes, and there are fresh daisies twisted into the knots of matted goat hair. An old woman with a hunchback stands outside with her hands clasped and hanging. She sizes you up and down with withered eyes. Ah, sellsword. No, a captain of sellswords. Or perhaps something more. You smell of a strange odor, and not just that of a man. Do you wish to have your fortune told? She gestures inside the tent. You see a number of long cards face down us in, across the table. Um, yeah, tell my fortune. Uh, you step into the tent, and its folds close, and you're in nothing but darkness. You stand there for a time and ask the woman where she went. Pursing her lips, or pursing your lips, you open the tent flap to bring in some light. The slip of light strikes a sheen from the darkness, and you turn around to see a dagger soaring forward. You block it away with your gauntlet and draw your sword and plunge it into the hag's chest. She drops the knife and clutches your shoulder. Such a monster you are, killing a kind old woman such as I. You'll die for this. You and your men will all die. You bring the witch in close and get a look at, at suddenly bright, wicked cat eyes. You spit and nod. For telling doom in a world where everything dies, not a hard job. Do you know what my job is, you witch? She grins a black rind of a gummy smile. Black blood spurts over her lips and she laughs. Oh, Sellsword, we shall see what you are when Dabkul has you in his hands. Okay, the cultists are definitely taking over. The witch's body goes limp, and your sword suddenly cuts straight through her flesh, leaving sliced flesh folding at your feet. Ew. You quickly exit the tent and have a whole thing burned. Some of the men swear they can see the woman's face grinning in the paws of the smoke. Ah. My cat is shedding all over my face, on purpose, just enjoys. So I have no idea where the oracle is or anything like that. It's possible it's over in the fog here, and I might pick up a pile of food and just go find out. Like I have money for 32 days. Uh, might as well sell these. I'll pick up their grain. Now would be a good time for the green skins to arrive, that they're standing around. Okay, the little farm stand didn't stand a chance. They're up here. Found him. Many orc young. eight of them. Figure out where they're going to be. Actually, let's move here. Get a little bit of a surround on them. So 
that was a bit more dangerous than I was hoping. You can wait. Looks like they're going up a bit. That was a good hit. That was a good hit. You can wait. He's dead. He's running. It's a good sign. You can wait. Knocked out again, and him. Damn. Okay, he's dead. Nice hit. You can wait. Okay, move up. Stabby. Nice. Almost dead. There we go. You can wait. Good wound on that. Now he's running. And he's got a massive headache. Okay. Toast. One left. Come on. At least he's running away. Yeah. <laughs> 
There we go. We've got one crushed finger. Everybody else seems fine. We got some loot, we got some food, we got plenty of equipment. Excellent. Nothing worth my time. Boogie. Only problem with working for these guys, they send you halfway across the damn map, and then they want you to come back and get paid. going to call it a day on this game at least uh, in a little bit maybe 10 15 minutes um, just because I'm gonna take a break get some food sort all that out see if I can uh, figure out a different game to play later because I still want to play Phoenix Point tonight uh, Gilded Ones have conquered the Fallen Star. What they plan to do with it, who knows. Maybe put up a gold-plated fence and keep the Northerners out. You're mostly concerned the fighting might be nearing an end, and with it, all sweet religious honey that left toes have been eating up. You know, I really want to know where these things are. Because I haven't a clue. Like, it says the Northerners and the Southerners, and I... Mm -hmm. I don't see him. No new jobs there. Back to here. Okay, sell you. Might as well get some smoked ham while I'm here. Just as a treat for the men. me to get his crystal skull back 750 how about 820 follow the tracks get the crystal skull I accept he's barely wounded he's barely wounded nobody leveled up from that last fight okay The Gilder's Gleam must be brighter than ever now. The Oracle has fallen under the control of the Southerners. Perhaps the Gilded Folk ha will ask the Left Toes to help defend it, or maybe the Old Gods will need a bit of proper gumption taking it back. Either way, the Left Toes are still on the catbird seat and fattening its purse. Seriously, though, no idea. Find a man sitting next to a hole in the ground. Beside him is a metal stake attached to which is a chain that runs into the hole. The hole is covered with goat skin. He regards you with a wave, but says if you want to see it, you'll have to pay. You ask what it is, and he grins. It's the darndest thing. A few armed men stand a ways off, no doubt, to a part of whatever scheme is in play here. I have a feeling they're thieves, but I'll give it a look. Uh, you flip the man a few coins, he bites them in his teeth, and you tell him to be wary of doing that. There's blood on some of them. He shrugs and pockets the pay. You come to the hole and the man throws the tarp off. A gruesome looking alp stares you and hisses you, hisses at you in rows of sharp teeth and a face like curtain made of pale flesh. There is a shackle around its neck and the man whistles as a reveal as though it was the first time he ever saw it there. Awful bugger, ain't it? Don't get too close, it'll have you seeing things. Unless you want to do that, of course. Some folks do. But if you start seeing things and you enjoy, then you gotta pay a little more. 
I could tell him you should kill it, or I could say good luck to you. Smoked ham is delicious, you're right. <laughs> so what do you think? Should I should I say you should kill it, or should I just bail? I don't like seeing anything captured, even if it's a hellish nightmare beast. I mean, I don't want to fight it either. <laughs> it is only one, I think, and it's daytime. I'm going to tell him you should kill it. Such hideous creatures cannot stand to survive. You tell the man that it's likely to get its way out of the hole at some point and start wreaking havoc on the world, if not more so than usual in a fit of primeval vengeance. The man spits. Go fark yourself. Get on out of here. You ain't getting your money back. You take one wrong step and I'll have to defend myself and my investment was a right bitch capturing that thing. So I can fight them and kill it myself. Or I can leave. So I'd, I don't have to fight it, but I could fight them. I feel like either way... I feel like fighting them is probably dangerous. Um, it's hard to say. <laughs> um... You know what? I'm going to I'm going to have to fight them and I'll kill it myself. Hey. You grab a spear from one of the guards and throw it into the pit, striking the elf through the brain pan. Its pale flesh deflates around the spear shaft as though you'd struck down an enormous curtain. The monster in enslaver draws a dagger and goes to stab you. Tark parries the blow and cuts the man across the throat. A few guards dive in the fray, all of them dying in quick and hurried fashion, though a few of the mercenaries get hurt in the fracas. With the violence over, you collect whatever gold the enslaver had on him, and you put the bodies dumped into the hole with the dead alp, and then fill it up. You got some light wounds. Everybody else is okay. How light are these wounds? Ugh, now everybody needs to wait for a day. Hey, day 100! Moving right along. Okay, you're partially healed. I'm gonna say that's probably enough. Seriously, the pathing on this is terrible. Follow the tracks. Follow the tracks. There we go. A brigand marksman and some raiders. I would rather attack them in daylight. Just to give my archers a chance. There we go. I don't like that they have a crossbow, but that's okay. Oh, and a longsword. Nice shot. That's okay. Ah, that looked like it was going to hit. <laughs> Okay, now you, 
Yeah, go down here. That's fine. That's fine, too. Ow! Bastard. Okay, that's so much for his shield. One hit down. Nice. Can wait. What a bastard. Okay, he needs to leave. You can go there. He's almost dead. <laughs> nice. Excellent pummel in the brain. You run away. Nice shot. That guy's all sorts of damaged. He's dead. <laughs> Excuse me. Aha, uh -huh. sorry, that was probably very loud. Aha! Uh -huh. Sorry about that. Alright, they're all dead. Uh, Walter got a pierced side and leg muscles. But we got some good equipment out of it, so whatever. Okay. Uh, let's level you up. Super Justin has reached level 3. And I really wish I could make you an archer. Let's do this, and this, and that. And let's make you... Let's make you level up faster. That's handy. Okay, there's that, and that, and that. And cause some more damage. Uh... Let's do this and that. Much better. And backstabber's always a good perk. Okay. Now how's everybody doing? Let's go and turn in this mission, and then I will probably call it there, to be honest.
longsword. Uh, doesn't look like they dropped the longsword, so I didn't get it. Um, these guys are trying to hunt me down, and that's not a good sign. Okay, run away. Managed to get around him. That makes me happy. Got paid. Excellent. I'll buy their other two. And I'm just going to do some quick selling here. And probably call it there, at least for now. Um, I will be back later on tonight. Um, <laughs> it won't be that long. I'll probably be back around, uh, oh, I'd say 8 or 9 my time. So, I'll see you guys then. Uh, I'm not, you're not going to miss anything. I won't continue this without being on stream. So, I hope you guys have an excellent day. And I'll see you guys shortly.